You're listening to the Achievement Radio Podcast, where you can unlock your full potential for success. Choosing the right goals. Everyone has a dream, a vision. In order to get to the ultimate state, one has to chalk out an exhaustive roadmap. This formal process of personal planning is called goal setting. Ambitious but finicky people set numerous goals, but are often clueless as to how to work toward achieving them. It's important to set the right goals that are realistic, yet challenging. Goals are normally set along different levels. We have just one life that God has given us. You cannot become a doctor, lecturer, CEO of a company, engineer, finance expert, lawyer, etc., all in one life. Hence, seek opinions and analyze your strengths and weaknesses. Put down in writing your large-scale goals. These goals must be further broken into smaller goals, then work toward each step by step. Prioritize your activities. For some people, family is more important than work, or vice versa. This depends on a lot of factors like values, attitudes, principles, upbringing, culture, and more. Hence, once your main goals are down, rank them in accordance to their importance. This helps in apportioning the appropriate time to each of the activities. Goal setting is certainly more than just scribbling on a piece of paper. It has a definite binding purpose. It's the roadmap to achieve your dreams. It has to be followed strictly. A lot of goals look nice and idealistic. However, unless the goal is something you really want with all your heart, you won't work toward it. Goals must be consistent with values, principles, and aptitudes. They shouldn't contradict each other. For example, with an annual income of $50,000, you can't want to buy a house that costs $900,000. Goals must be set in various areas family, career, health, social, educational, financial. This way, there's a balance that's maintained in all areas and leads to a wholesome development as an individual. However, importance given to each area may vary. Believe in the power of positivity. Writing down goals leads our subconscious mind to follow those instructions. The more positive the instructions, the more positive the results. When you aim at the moon, you'll shoot at the stars. If you miss the moon, Don't aim at a tree, you'll shoot at the ground. Ensure that your goals are set high. They should be challenging, yet achievable. Concentrating on adding value to yourself every day. We should live every day and not just exist. Fill yourself with positive thoughts, always. Write your goals down and put that list up in a prominent place on the wall. Read it every day. Put it on your cell phone as notes. Also, make a copy of the goals on a Word document on your desktop or laptop. Review your goals on a daily and weekly basis. Make it part of your routine. Visualize yourself having achieved those goals. See in your mind's eye the benefits and fruits of your goals. Your subconscious mind will automatically drive you to get there. Resist temptation. Ask yourself, will this action take me closer to my goals? If the answer is yes, don't pause. You know what to do. Thank you for being a part of the Achievement Radio podcast today. Your support means everything to us.